In this video, I'm going to show you one of my favorite passing concepts from the Gun Bunch tight end. It's one of the glitchiest routes of the game, and I'm going to break it down for you here in just a second. But before I do that, I want to let you know that if you've never been to the channel before, I want to thank you for taking time to watch this video. I also want to let you know that my channel is all about how to become a better Madden player in Madden 21. And so if you're looking to get, become a better player, uh, what I want you to do is go ahead and hit the subscribe button at the bottom right-hand corner of your screen. That will help you get better at this game because we upload videos videos every single day. We upload about eight of them a day. And so if you don't want to miss any of those videos, that subscribe button will help you know whenever a new video comes out. All right, guys. So I wanted to talk to you today a little bit about the bunch tight end offense. This is the offense that I have been running and will be running in the Madden Classic. In my opinion, it is the best offense in Madden 21 for the fact that it works very similar to trips tight end, but also very similar to gun bunch. And what we're going to talk about today is a route combination that you can use that will create essentially the same kind of thing that happens from the Z-Spot bunch play um, to the bunch side. We're going to show you how to do that to the tight end side out of the bunch tight end. So I'm really excited about this video. And if you want to get a free sample to the bunch tight end offensive ebook, that is in my text membership, which is completely free to you to pick up. Uh, all you have to do to sign up for that is just text me. My phone number is in the top left-hand corner of your screen. And if you want to get the full ebook, that is in the description. Okay, guys. So... What we're going to primarily show you here is this play tight end corner. And the reason I like this play so much is because if you smart route this post route, you're going to see that it essentially is kind of almost like a slant out uh, when we motion it over. And so all we're going to do here is we're going to create a curl flat concept on the left side. So we're going to flat Adams and we're going to curl Vada Scantling. From that point, we're going to streak the tight end. And that's pretty much the setup. That's all we're going to do. But essentially what we're going to do here is you're going to see that I'm going to motion Tavon Austin to the right. And I'm going to snap him right about here. And what you'll see is against Mabel coverages, he will actually get fairly decent separation. Now right there, I believe the cover three from this the cover three from the 335 normal is the one that does probably the best job um, as far as defending this. But I will show you this again, and you'll see that it consistently this this corner route um, or this curl flat route you can basically pass lead this with because you have gunslinger on aaron Rodgers, you can pass lead it both underneath the zone and on top of the zone and you can also play with the motion snaps so for example i could try motion snapping him and get him all the way out to the numbers kind of similar to the mesh play and i'll do this as well and you'll see here i mean this is wide open i mean this is layup it's a layup every single time it's a layup it's very difficult to stop this play and so what people will begin to do is they'll begin to begin Mabel coveraging on both sides. So you see here you'll get something like this. And what this allows for the offense is it really does a good job of opening up this curl route, curl flat concept here to the left side. It also, you can still hit this route against Mabel coverage because of that streak. Because of that streak to the tight end, it's going to pull all of the deep blue zones with him. And this is one of the, I mean, this is one of my secret little plays that I really need to probably call a little bit more of next weekend because it's very similar to the mesh play on the bunch side. You're just creating the same concept here on the right. And as you can see, zone drops aren't going to do anything. Literally are going to do nothing to stop this route. Now let's say that they are running a lot of cover two. Um, and I'm going to show you that here in a second. Um, let's say that they're running a lot of cover two zone on you. So they may do something like this and essentially flip it, and they're going to call uh, Tampa 2, cover 2 sink or something, right? And they're going to basically Mabel coverage that side, and now you would believe that they probably might have a decent chance. So uh, let me just show you what we're going to do here. Essentially, we're going to do that, okay? Um, so we have Mabel coverage on that side, tight in corner, and let me just show you the route to Tavon Austin. So if we, both, if we get him all the way to the outside and we snap him right about here, if you watch, he's still going to be open. Because of that gunslinger ability, you're going to be able to get the ball out quick, and you're going to be able to get the ball out accurately enough for you to be able to hit that. And really what they're going to have to do is they're going to have to play some type of cover two, um, or they're going to have to go to something like this, right? This is cover three Mabel, and now the safety is out there. Um, and again, this is probably still not going to stop this. This is this is one of my favorite ways to beat zone coverage in the entire game. But you'll see here, get him out there wide enough, and then it's just a hard right pass lead. Because of that streak pulling the deep blue zones out of the way, you're not going to have to worry about that as much. And that's why the streak is so important uh, from this. Another thing that they can do that will help them stop this route is they can play essentially cover four uh, defense 
on that outside. So they're going to put that outside outside corner uh, in a quarter uh, zone. So he's going to play kind of outside a little bit. And you'll see here, even that, I mean, he does break on the ball a little bit better. But what that's going to cause is let's say that they do that out of a cover three. So I'm going to go to cover three. I'm going to outside quarter him, and then I'm going to uh, put that flat out there just like that, just like we, the same concept we just ran. Now what I want you to do is watch your tight end shriek up the scene. Now, again, their user will be here and all this stuff. But if you watch here, this middle of the field is wide open. With an easy pass lead to the right side, you're going to be able to torch that defense and get over the top. Oftentimes, they're going to go user the curl flat concept. So now they have to take the streak, which in, in turn, a lot of times will leave the curl flat open on the back side. So that's the bunch tight end, tight end corner. It's one of the plays that you need to learn how to run. It's one of the most effective plays in the game. The fact is you could also do it very uh, – another thing that you could do is let's say they're running a lot of cover two on you. You could use your PA cross play um, to kill cover two. It's a cover two killer. So essentially you're going to streak Tunyon and then smart route uh, square. Uh, and what you're going to see here is the square receiver is going to get a one play touchdown against cover two every single time. If they run cover two with a deep half, they're not going to, they're, they're never going to be able to stop this play right here. So uh, what it forces people to have to do is it forces people to have to run um, some type of cover four defense on that side of the field. And then they likely, in all likelihood, you're going to see that they're going to run something like this on the back side, which is going to then open up curl flat corner pretty much all day long. You're going to be able to throw curl flat corner with a lot of success. And I was able to do that a lot in the Madden Classic. So I need to run this play more. I bet you probably do as well. Thanks for watching this video. If you want to get the full ebook, the link is in the description of this video. And if you want to get a free sample to the full ebook, that is in my text message membership, which all you got to do to get that is text me. My number is 812 216 3644. And the text membership is free and will always be free uh, for you guys. I'm actually really, really excited about how far that has come and will continue to grow in that. So so thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. And just a quick reminder, we'll be streaming tonight at 10 o'clock on YouTube. And if you want to get that full ebook for Bunch Tight End, it is in the description of this video. Thanks, and we'll see you on stream tonight.